more slowly. Hey, plant fam. <laughs> I don't even know. So, Jordan's home today, so I thought I would invite him along for this epic unboxing. Well, it's it's pretty cool. Yeah. This was an epic unboxing. Yes. The king and the queen. Oh, P.S. Before anybody comments on our shirts, we're that couple. <laughs> We have actually yeah. a lot of matching outfits. Like, I say outfits. I make it sound like we have, like, matching jogging suits. <laughs> if we jog, we probably would. <laughs> yeah, we don't jog. No. <laughs> um, okay, so we do have a box to open today. and uh, But before I do get into that, I do want to say thank you so, so, so much um, for all of the amazing comments that uh, we got on my uh, hashtag planty kindness project video um, I I couldn't be happier with how well received it was and I'm um, yeah I'm humbled I just want to say thank you so so much uh, and I hope we can continue this going and I hope that you know, um, I actually told one of my subscribers, you know, if it even helps one person, uh, then, you know, that is, that is a job well done. Uh, that was my goal. I just, I mean, one person would be good. If I made one person smile and I don't know, I don't know. I'm not going to get all savvy again. I cried once on camera. <laughs> Nobody wants to see that again. Any who... We have a box here, and we're going to open it. And not just any box. Not just any box. Box from House of Monstera. Yes. Monstera. Yes. I feel like, you know, you know, it's funny. So in the beginning, like, my, un my unboxings and stuff like that, I'd get from, like, these different places, and I would, you know, get from, like, Etsy, things like that. Now, like, every unboxing is House of Monstera, because why? Because I'm obsessed. No, you know what? Truthfully though, it's because their plants are amazing. Um, these guys are fantastic. You know what I mean? Like they're just they're just great people. And I don't I, even buy plants from them, and I think they're great. <laughs> they are. They are. They're so Absolutely. I agree. And lovely. I agree. Anyway, I won't get all sappy about them, but yes. know that. I do think they're fantastic. Not that less sapping, more unpacking. Ah, I see what you did there. <laughs> I'm a poet and wasn't even aware of the fact that I was making those rhymes. <laughs> I was expecting and I didn't know it. Like, no. no. Oh. I can't take credit for that. I got that off Brooklyn Nine Nine. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, Raymond Old. Okay, so fun fact about Jordan. He can watch something like a TV show or a movie or hear a quote once and recall it forever. If I like it. If I really enjoy it or I find it funny. Yeah. Yeah. It is the, like... The man of many useless talents. I was going to say, it's like the most useless. useless talent. Now, if he could remember the things that I've asked him to do, like put oil in my car. I put oil in your car. I've been asking you for like three weeks. It's not been three. It's been three days. Is that what we're going to do today? We're going to fight? Yeah. Oh. It's not been three weeks. Don't listen to this. It's not been three it's weeks. It's been like maybe it four. Not. It has not. <laughs> okay. Maybe we should just unbox this plant. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We're going to. We'll be right back and we're going to unbox this plant before. <laughs> before fists fly. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> okay, so I apologize for my cat meowing in the background. Okay, now that I'm feeling better, I think it's safe for me to use a knife. Safe for who? Thanks. You're welcome. You're 
in my bubble. You're in my bubble. Talk about it in my bubble. <laughs> Just cut the box. Uh, maybe, maybe it was a better idea if you did it. Probably. Just say, I, I told these people the last time. Couple, As you shake couple, the knife, and I told them. <laughs> a couple unboxings ago, I was like, don't let me use a knife again. Here we are. Where were you on that one, plant fam? <laughs> if this slips, I'm going to stab you. Like, by accident. Not on purpose. Uh -huh. Foreshadowing? <laughs> Can you do that when you're just, like, winging TV? It's... You know what? I do have to make a comment on that whole time. I don't like this. Put the knife down. Put the knife down. Give me. Get, get that. Wait, no. I, so, <laughs> here's the cool thing that I honestly recently realized about YouTube. It is replacing television. Like, most of the that. people that I know. That and Netflix. Yeah, watch like YouTube and Netflix as they're sit down after a hard day's work or whatever yeah. and watch TV. Yeah. Like we used to have cable TV, but you're paying like 150 bucks a month easy for channels that you don't even really want because they split it up so you get one channel that you want. But you have to get a package with like five, six, seven other channels that you have you want nothing to do with, but it's Cable TV one. rant. Yeah, it's expensive and stupid. It is. So we got rid of that because we were tired of paying. Are you scared? I'm concerned. <laughs> um, but you know what though? It it benefits us actually. And well, I know, like I found, like a lot of the times you pay that money. Yeah, you have the channels that you want, but. You know, it's funny how many channels you can actually get on cable and how... M and you have to watch, like, three minutes of commercials. On YouTube, you might watch, yeah, like, like you'll 10 have, You'll have, like, a one-hour show, and 35 to 40 minutes of that might be commercials or some stupid thing like that. It's ridiculous. <laughs> and then you'll want to watch cable, and there's nothing on. It's true. You have 200-plus channels or whatever and it is now, and Jack like, there's literally Nilly's nothing watch. on when you want to watch something. The box is open. Did you say something again? I didn't. I smiled. What when you mean? edit this, you see. It's so so My weird. invoice. No fake. Do you remember how you do this? Okay. It's Christmas. Oh, wait. Yes. Wait, so there's nothing in anything. I'm always afraid I'm going to throw a plan out. some milk on it and find out. No. <laughs> <laughs> and no. they sent us can, is that focusing? I don't I you know what I, honestly anything. I don't have my glasses on so I can't tell I if got, it's I focusing. Did it. I did it. I so did it. this stuff is actually great although it does I, from what I understand Fish emulsion smells really bad. So this is an or, uh, organic, and I've seen this before. I actually <clears throat> started using this not long ago. So it's so awesome that they sent me this, and that's great. So it actually has um, uh, phytoplankton. I don't have my glasses on. <laughs> organic <laughs> marine phytoplankton. Yes. Thank you. So it smells like fart water. <laughs> So, like, 
<laughs> Not even kidding. You open a bottle of this stuff up. I mean, I'm sure it's fantastic for the plants. It, the, my plants are but really enjoying it. It stinks. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it really smells oh, bad. That is so Please. so awesome. Thank you so much, guys. Love that your faces. Really cool. That is so cool. And we got this, or you got and this. And the sphag moss. Premium New Zealand sphagnum moss harvested from the pristine environment of New Zealand's southern west coast. Or. Or. Weedabix. <laughs> yeah, but don't pour milk over this and throw it in the microwave. You will be disappointed. I'm going to make your breakfast tomorrow. No, you're not. You won't lose this. <laughs> you're right. Don't call my bluff. That's rude. I know. I know. Actually, I was telling Christian that today. So, another fun fact. Jordan and I have known each other for 13 years? 14 years. I think it's 13. Maybe going on 14. Since 2005, right? Yeah, so yeah, it's about 14 years, I guess. 14 long. And we were best friends for like ever. Yeah. We're, like we're, ever. We're close. And it was like, just about like legit. I know people are going to go, yeah, right. Yeah, you guys are like, no, <laughs> like not at all. We were just best friends. And it just so happened that he thought I was like, in the last few years. <laughs> it's true. And then we just happened it's to true. be, you know, in the right place in our lives and whatever. And here we are. Here we are. Yay us. King and queen. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> because we're... All right. Anyway, enough about us. You interrupted me. I'm sorry. No, it's too late now. It's over. Okay. I'm not sorry anymore. Oh, oh, I thought that was a dog. Oh, I should have the scissors. We can do this. The moment you've all been waiting for. Do you remember what this is? Don't say it, because you'll blow it for everybody else. Honestly, don't. Really? You guys ready? So... When I ordered the VTI, the Roquenum, and the, what else did I get? The Billetai and the Rayi. When I ordered those, this was in and out of my cart. <laughs> like, I can't even, I can't tell you how many times. So finally, I just did it. Here it is. Here it is. Oh man, it's a little stuck on the bottom. Cat's looking to take Our cat likes to chew on tape. Yeah, it's kind of messed up. I don't know why. At Christmas, it's a, it's a nightmare. Doesn't eat or anything. Just like just chew. Oh, the it's sound like the of sound. It, like sound or it maybe or? it's like the mm. Ivy. Nobody wants to hear you. Sorry. <gasps> I'm getting there. I've had a couple people on uh, my Instagram because I posted that I had this box that had arrived at work. And people were like, that's mean. <laughs> I have to wait all day. To I'm so sorry, but you're about to see it. Are you ready? Yeah. This is so cool. Oh. I am so excited. Okay, look at this plant. Oh my gosh. Do you remember what it is now? Nope. So this is, look at the back of those leaves. So amazing. So it does look kind of like the Billetai. Uh, it is a philodendron. Ooh. Um, this one is more of a climber and whatnot. That one you can put on a moss pole and it'll kind of just come out. But this one actually. Stuff too. Yeah. Same like uh, Velcro. This one will actually attach itself to like a moss pulling climb. So this is a philodendron out of Bapawenzi. Out of Bapawenzi. <laughs> it's fun to say. It is kind of fun to say. Philodendron out of Bapawenzi. 
<laughs> it's a good thing I love you. <laughs> I guess it is. Anyway, I love, I know, I know, I know. I put a ring on it. This he tells me all the time when I call him like, you know. Yeah. And as he just finished telling the people, she knew me for a very long it's time. True. So when this stuff happens, I don't feel sorry for it because she knew what she was getting into and she still put a ring on it. So. You know now I'm going to get questions about, because we're not married and they know this. No. I so don't. I'm going to get questions about that. So I'm just going to leave them in suspense. There you go. You know what we should do? We should do like a QA. and a Yeah. That'd be kind yeah. of fun. Do you guys think that'd be fun? That'd be interesting. Would you want to do a Q&A? So maybe... We'll, we'll say in the comments, if you have any questions that you want to ask in a Q&A, go ahead and throw them in the comments. Also, um, it, this is, I'm so winging this. <laughs> this is totally unexpected. Um, <laughs> so I got the vapors. <laughs> <laughs> the vapors? The vapors. Well, I know that, but you said vapors. Vapors? I don't know. I'm trying to put an accent on it. It'd be funny. Was it like a movie or a show? <laughs> I don't know. I can't remember where I heard that from. Somewhere. Probably from someone, yeah. Anywho. It doesn't matter. So, if you have a question, let's, I think it'd be kind of fun for Jordan and I to do a Q&A. So, throw any questions that you have. Uh, just put, uh, like, Q&A question or Q&A question mark, and then ask your question. If it's a question for the Q&A, if you just have a regular question that you just, like, need to answer in the comments, just type your regular question. And also, ask me on Instagram. I'll put my Instagram, I'll put it here. <laughs> I'll put it there. <clears throat> and then uh, you can actually go on Instagram and um, you can send me a message or uh, maybe I'll do like a story, like ask me a question or I think you can do that. I I'm new to that world. I don't, I'm trying. And I'm not a part of that world at all, so I have no idea. <laughs> okay. Anyways, back to the plant. Back to the plant. They want to see the plant. Okay. So I'm going to try to get some close ups here. So there is the front. Look at the back of those leaves. Oh my goodness. How great is that? Like I'm, I'm so glad I finally just put it in my cart and cashed out. I love this plant. This is so great. It does look pretty neat. It's so cool. You're liking that one, huh? I do like that one. <laughs> so, <clears throat> I did want to say, because I forgot to say it last week. So, this Billetai, um, I can't remember if it was Barsha Christian that I was talking to. Now they're going to yell at me because I don't remember who it was. I feel like it was probably Bryce, but anyway, <clears throat> I'm sure like everybody who has a Billetai calls the Billetai Billy. But when he said it to me, I laughed and thought that was amazing and said, okay, so this plant is now named Billy because of... <laughs> was it Bryce or Christian? I feel so bad now. Either one of them. I don't know. But it was so funny. So that's Billy. But I can't figure out a short name for this guy. Bap. Bap. Out of Bap of Wednesday. Because it's got like the most kick in the name. Out of. Bap a Wednesday. Bap. Bap, bap. <laughs> oh my god. I am so sorry. No, you're not. Sorry, not sorry. Is I knew, I knew. Alright. She liked it, so she put a ring on it. Oh god. Are you singing Beyonce? Poorly. You're poorly. Very poorly. As long as you know that. Yeah, I can't sing. And I'm okay. <laughs> okay, well, we should probably wrap up this video because <sighs> they came to see the plant. We gotta get the out of Bapoenzi in a pop. No, we don't actually. No? Uh, no. Bryce and Christian contacted me and said that this guy's recently potted up and recently rooted, so we are leaving him. I'll take this stuff <laughs> off, but I'm leaving him in there until the spring. We're getting too late in the season now to start. Uh, potting and stuff like that. So by the time the sp that spring rolls around, his roots will be nice and strong. 
You can put them in a new pot, and he'll be good. So we gotta get him on a shelf then. I need, I need more shelves. <laughs> yeah, you bought two not long ago. They're full. Well, they've seen them in the video. Right. Yeah. I need to do something with my green wall. With all <clears throat> that. Anyway, we could just oh, we sit here and ramble on forever and. I don't know about you, but I probably wouldn't yeah. watch that. Maybe I would. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know. Anyways, so thank you guys so much, as usual, for watching. Um, thank you for liking and commenting. I absolutely love comments. As uh, anyone will tell you, I always reply to all of the comments, um, usually within about 24 hours. If I have to work, if it's through the week, then, you know priorities I guess <laughs> but um, I will eventually get back to everyone um, and I really enjoy that I really enjoy meeting you guys and having a little bit more of a one-on-one -on -one kind of conversation or connection um, so yeah go ahead and throw some comments down there and um, if you haven't subscribed already hit please. that subscribe button smash it is that what they say Smash that subscribe button. Smash that subscribe button. You know you want to. <laughs> he watches too many YouTube videos. Smash <laughs> that button. What are you doing? <laughs> oh, man. Um, and then go ahead and hit your notify bell so that you... So that you're notified when I... What are you doing? You're creeping me out. Here's why you're creeping me out. I don't have my glasses on, so I can't really see the face that you're making. <laughs> Do you know I mean? That's only smiling. Oh, okay. Oh, sorry, Ivy. I just kicked the cat. Okay. Anyway, guys, have a lovely evening, afternoon, day. I never know how to say that because they couldn't. Maybe, maybe some people aren't Depends watching it tonight. Watching and where they're from. Yeah, and what if it's like a month from now and somebody's watching this video? Have a good Enjoy your day day when you get there. Sure. <laughs> That'll work. <laughs> Alright guys. Just trying to help. Thanks again and thank you again for all the love on uh hashtag planty kindness project. I am going to put the hashtag up here. If you can um I'm trying to think of the word, relay this, use this hashtag um, on your Instagram. If you're a YouTuber, use it on your YouTube. Um, we're trying to spread more kindness. This world is full of so much negativity that every little extra bit of kindness that we can spread, the better. Um, you know, if you don't have Instagram and you're not a YouTuber, then, you know, say something nice to somebody today. Just turn to somebody and say, you have really nice eyes. I know. See? And it makes them feel better. And honestly, you will feel so much better for just being nice to somebody. It's actually a really good feeling to bring somebody up. Instead of bringing them down. Yeah. Don't be a jerk. Yeah. Don't. Be... Hashtag, don't be a jerk. <laughs> you know, I wasn't sure how well that, that title was going to go over. But you know what? I it kept works. it real. It, it's true. It's that's true. What we, need. We, need, so, we need to keep it real. Well, that's me. No more sugar coating. It's not very often I beat around the bush about anything. That's true. Yeah. Which does get me into some hot water sometimes. I'll front it in your face. Yes. Anyway, thanks again. I always say thanks like 13 times because then I get rambling about something else. Say it one more time. It makes a nice even number. 14? Yeah. Thanks so much again. Have a lovely evening, afternoon, day, weekend, month, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Wave. Bye, guys. Bye. Hey, guys. Um, so I did mention in my last video that at the end of every video um, with the hashtag Planty Kindness Project that I was going to feature um, a small, ch a smaller channel, an up and coming channel, a new channel, a baby channel, um, someone smaller than myself. Um, <clears throat> I myself am a baby channel. I am just, just crawling my way up there. Um, 
but I know that it was a big deal to me when, um, you know, any channel larger than myself would mention us or <laughs> speak to me and acknowledge my existence. So I thought, um, and I know that that made me smile. So I am hoping that this makes um, someone smile. Um, so the person that I'm going to feature today has actually been one of my subscribers um, almost since the very beginning. She always comments on all of my videos. She's a very sweet lady. She's extremely knowledgeable. Um, she has a small channel, not a whole lot of videos as of yet. Um, however, I think she's just getting started. Um, she loves orchids and succulents and... Um, <clears throat> So I am going to feature today Kathleen Murphy. So Kathleen, thank you so much for watching all my videos and and subscribing and you know doing everything that you do to try to share your knowledge and uh, it's very much appreciated. Um, and I hope this this helps you out and I hope this makes you smile because that really is my goal is just to make somebody smile so um, guys go ahead and check Kathleen's channel out especially if you're an orchid lover um, I don't do orchids they terrify me <laughs> um, but uh, Kathleen fortunately does so if you like orchids go check her channel out if you type in YouTube and type in Kathleen Murphy that's Kathleen with a K Murphy and then type in orchids her channel will come right up for you um, and yeah so go check out our channel. I hope you enjoy it. And uh, that is today's hashtag planty kindness project moment. Mwah! <laughs> you do have a lot of those like, I don't know how you do that. That's like a gift. I wish I could do that. Like, what's your, what's your favorite one? I don't know. There was one I remember as a kid. Um, it was from Liar Liar. Like, um, and Jim Carrey? It, yeah. And there was a scene where he gets pulled over by a cop after, like, speeding through traffic. And the cop comes up to him. And, uh, th this one I had to actually try... Like, th there was a lot. And, like, I remember as a kid, like, I don't know, I wanted to get this so badly. So the cop comes up to the vehicle and he says, do you know why I pulled you over? And Jim Carrey's character says, it depends on how long you were following me. So he's, and if you haven't seen this movie, like, he, his kid makes a wish that his dad couldn't tell lies. So now he's forced to tell the truth against his will. Like, he doesn't realize that he's, this is what he's doing. So after he says that to the cop, the cop says, why don't we just take it from the top? And he goes, here goes, I sped, I followed too closely, I ran a stop sign, I almost hit a Chevy, I sped some more, I failed to yield at a crosswalk, I changed lanes at an intersection, I changed lanes without signaling while running a red light and speeding. <laughs> and the cop says, is that all? And he says, no, I have unpaid parking tickets. And he pushes his glove box open and all these tickets come pouring out. And then he says, be gentle. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, here's the... Funny part. I almost I almost said a potty word. <laughs> How long has it been since you last saw that movie? Oh god. It's gotta be years. Like what are we talking? I'd say in the six to ten year range. <laughs> oh my god. Because it was one, of, it was one of those movies. Like I watched it a few times in the beginning. It was funny, and then I wanted to get that part down, so I got that part down. This is probably shortly after, not when it was in theaters, but it came out on DVD. And um, and yeah, like it was just one of those movies. I watched it for a bit then, and it was just something I never really went back to because I I found it funny, but it was just. You only watch the movie so many times. I'm like a yeah. one-time movie watcher, but Jordan can even watch a movie one time and he recalls things. Yeah, He's been watching, right? we've been watching all of the um, bad lip reading. Yeah. Oh, my, if you haven't seen any of the bad lip reading videos, 
go look it up on YouTube. It is so funny. So... <laughs> uh, they do Star Wars. They do... And they even make their Walking own songs. Dead, Stranger Things. Which, yeah, Stranger Things. The Walking Dead is where I got started with it. He'll just randomly... Like, we'll be talking. We'll be having a conversation. And he'll start, like, reciting them. And I'm like, what... <laughs> Are you reciting about lip reading again? <laughs> I think I've even got the kids doing it. They really enjoy that. <laughs> yeah, the kids think it's hilarious. The kids. Anyway. <laughs> that's funny. You got a taste of one of my useless talents. It's great at parties. It's true. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>